Hello everyone, my name is Jason Hong and today I'm gonna show you um, this pressure plate and door setup that I've programmed in Unreal Engine 5. So just a short demonstration. If our character steps over these pressure plates, they depress, I guess. And then if all three of them are pressed down at, this, at the same time, see you can use these blocks to also hold them down and if you if all three are pressed down the door opens yep and uh, let's take a look at our uh, blueprint so it's called fresh pressure plate blueprint this is what I named my blueprint and if we take a look inside it it is basically so like these are just cylinders basically and um, they have this capsule collision around it which detects the collision of player characters or uh, physics objects like those cubes and then connected here are this basically just a rectangle acting as our door and if we look at the code um, it looks pretty complicated, but it's not really that much. Um, I don't think that code is needed. So yeah, <clears throat> when you begin overlap with one of those collision capsules, capsule collisions, um, it is connected to a move component. So basically, it just moves the pressure plate um, negative ten in the z direction. So that does the animation of the pressure plate. It goes into the ground. Yep. And it also sets a boolean value. Um, keep kept track here. It's called pl plate one pressed. If it's pressed down, somebody is uh, pressing it down, it's going to set the boolean value. And on the contrary, if you end your overlap with the casual collision, then um, the pressure plate will be moved back to its original position and the boolean value is unset. So yeah, these are the exact same things. It's just for those three different pressure plates. Plate one, plate two, plate three. And then we come here. So every event tick, there's gonna be a branch condition if play one is pressed uh, and it's true then uh, it connects here play two pressed and then connects here play three play uh play three pressed so if all three plates are pressed down it's gonna activate and then moving it's, it's gonna move the door the door it's gonna move negative 90 rotation in the z direction opening the door um, if either one of them one of these are false then the door is just gonna close um, that's basically it for the code this code here is um, is something else that I was testing I ended up not using these so we don't need to worry about these so final look at the pressure plates so at first, they're just existing. When you slip, step on it, it goes negative 10, uh, pressing down. When you end overlap, it comes back. That is all for today. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.